we are going to continue using Simpson's rule. So Simpson's rule is technically, uh, basically, this uh, similar to trapezo trapezium rule. Instead, uh, instead of using trapezoid, he uses three points wherein in makaform siya og parabola. Kaganina trapezoid nanto na. In parabola, familiar mo sa area na uh, taking the area depende kung asya siya concave or convex na tayo area makuha nga 1 third base uh, base 1 plus base 2 times height or 2 thirds na siya, depende na siya so yan ang nga pag derive uh, sa iyang formula therefore ang area ni Simpson's rule limit at A to B is just equal to nagya punta h karon pero this time one third na tong formula h multiplied by karon ang first og uh, initial og last equation na to ibutang na nato sa pinaka last karon so natay uh, f of x not pinaka na rather no f of x n dayon ang gasunod aning fx nat which is fx1 will have a multiplier of 4 f x1 then plus 2 f x2 plus 4 f x3 plus 2 f x4 and so on and so forth and to maput tag 4 or 2 yeah it either 4 or either 2 nga function of x n minus 1. So, muna siyang general formula ni uh, Simpson's rule. So, if mapansin niyo similar lang siya, ang 1 third lang nalahi o ang 4 to 4 to nga alternating after ni fx not. So, let's try to compute a, an equation. No? Let's say we have this uh, equation. 1, uh, 7 square root of uh, x cubed minus x dx of course uh, sa, maski sa inyo ma, maski sa inyo medyo tricky ni siya i, in, i anti derivative pero uh, we will use Simpson's rule in order to get the area at bounded by 1 and 7 so karon uh, ang intervals nga gipangayo ni uh, diari n is equal to 6 therefore h na to is equal to b minus a all over n which is equal to 7 minus 1, 7 of 1, all over 6. Therefore, ang h na to is equal to 1. Then, sir, what's the value of 1? So, 1 is will be the, your, kwan, example mo na yung fx not ni mo. Always ka mag-increase of 1 dyan. So, fx not ni mo is lower, val, lower boundary, which is 1. fx1 will then be equal to 1 plus 1, 2 fx2 is equal to 3 fx4 is equal to 3 di 3 is equal to 4 fx4 is equal to 5 fx6 is equal to uh, 5 is equal to 6 then fx n na to n kay n naman na siya or fx6, or fx6 is equal to 7 so karon plug in na na ito eh, fx and fx na pinakauna. So, sa formula na to in taking this area, area bounded by one, by this function at 1 to 7 is just equal to 1 third multiplied by height na to nga 1. No? Multiplied by function with respect to 1 or function with respect to 7. So, square root of 1 cube minus 1 plus square root of 7 cube minus 7 plus kung saan man itong gasunod aning fx not fx1 so therefore multiplier nga 4 pinakauna square root of 2 2 cube minus 2 kay 2 man isa plus alternate 2 square root of 3 cube minus 3 plus alternate 4 square root of 4 cube minus 4 plus 2 square root of 5 cube minus 5 
plus lastly 4 6 cube minus 6 so makita ninyo yung pattern no nga similar lang siya very similar lang siya sa trapezium rule so karon natay 1 third kini siya square root of 0 kini siya square root of 36 kini 4 multiplied by 2 cube is 8 minus 2 equals 6 Tini, 3 cube minus 3, so 27 minus 3, 24. So 2 square root of 24 plus 4. 4 cube is uh, ilan eh? 64 minus 4, 60. So 4 square root of 60 plus tini, 5 cube is 125 minus 5, 120. So five, uh, 2 multiplied by square root of 120. Then lastly, tini, 4. 6 cube is 6 by 6, 36 by 6 is equal to 2, 1, 6, 2, 1, 6. So, minus 6 is equal to 2, 10. So, mana sa. Uh, so, di na lang yung makayag. Kuan, mag-calcute ta. The area will then be is equal to 1 third multiplied by square root of 236 plus 4 square root of 6. 6 plus 2 square root of 24 plus 4 square root of 60 plus 2 square root of 120 plus 4 square plus 4 square root of 210 so therefore atong value nga nakuha is 49.59483 or let's say 49.595 So, money ang area using Simpsons rule.